Hi guys, this is Elias and I hope you're fine and doing well. In this video, I will tell you how you can sign up for a Stripe account. Stripe account is for to receive payments from your clients, from your websites or for your company. It allows you to accept credit cards from your clients or from your website. And it should be the preferred option on your website to have an option to receive payments from your customers through card system. And Stripe is all about this. So scroll down and click start now. Before moving forward, I would like to tell you that I am registering this account on behalf of my USA friend. He is from United States and I am registering account for him on his behalf and here we go. First you need to enter your email. It can be your business or personal email. And then your full name. It do not support all of the countries and it allows some of the countries you can check from the list if your country is in the list. But I would like to tell you that it accepts credit cards from worldwide. But it do not allow all of the country's merchant to join that website registered for it. And in the case if your country is not in this type registered list. So what you have to do, you have to look for a friend or a family friend from the listed countries so that they can help you to register for Stripe account. And in the last enter your password and create account. So we have created account but we have not done yet. We have to do some more things in order to activate our account. First is to verify our email address. So now I have confirmed my email address and the next process is to add my business details. Click start. First is the country you can select and then the address and then the type of your business. I will go with the individual and continue. And then the legal name of the person, email address, date of birth, scroll down and the address again and then the phone number and some more information. Tell more about your business, what is about. And your business website if you do not have business website you can use your social profiles as well and description about your business or services you are providing after providing product description click continue and this is about fulfillment details mean that how you fulfill orders of your customers it's asking on average how long after paying will your customers typically receive their goods or services you are providing and you can select whatever the date is and in my case it is within one day and click continue and this is the customer support details and these are the information which may be visible to the customers when they are paying online to you and the first is the statement descriptor what is that if someone pays you then on their card it will reflect as the payment where you have paid and it should be accurate so that you can avoid chargeback they cannot make chargeback in mistakes so you have to be accurate there enter such information which can be identified them on the customers and when the customers say their statements so that they can recognize why they paid to this company and what is the services they got from there and the next is the shortened descriptor and then the customer support phone number and then the country and address click continue and then you have to enter your bank details so they can date you payouts and this option is not same for every country for every country the option will be different like different bank accounts so this account is usa based so only usa based bank accounts will be visible there i have entered my bank details and now continue so this is the two-step authentication i will now set up this you can use sms or you can also use authenticator app as well so i use their authenticator app now let me verify this and let's continue and this is the automated sales tax calculation and select like the appropriate category suits your business model select the category and click continue and this is the optional part if you want to join the climate change program you can otherwise you can click not now this is the page where you can review details you can scroll down and read all the details if something is not accurate you can do changes as well and after verifying all the details click submit so I have created my account successfully. So this was how you can sign up for Stripe and use it. And in the upcoming days, I will create videos on how to use Stripe and the best ways to utilize Stripe for your business. So this is how you can do sign up on Stripe successfully. And I told you all the procedure. I hope you will love this video. Click like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click bell icon for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.